exactly 10 months after the last one, we finally have one again. Yes, it's the Backyard Games 2020. Well, maybe at least the first one, because you know how we always have a summer one in July every year. But that's completely 100% not confirmed as of right now. But I'm pretty sure there'll probably be a summer one probably this July, like usual. But here's the main one of the year, which pretty much combines every single Backyard Games into one event. Into one single Backyard Games. Now that's crazy. So... What am I waiting here for? Let's get into it! Hey guys, it's me, the Lego Master 627, and today I am back with another backyard video. So, guys, today it is Wednesday, May 13th, 2020. Now, I know there's probably not even supposed to even be an episode today, but. Because I've not really been doing that many episodes recently over the last 10 days now, pretty much. Yesterday I made the return. And I also said I would be making more episodes throughout the week. So, yeah. Then there is one tomorrow, though. But, um, yeah guys, today, as you probably could have seen, the Backyard Games 2020 is here. And it is the biggest Backyard Games I think we have ever seen here. So, guys, without further ado... Let's get right into it. Now, as you can see by the logo, it pretty much has every single game that we have had in the back of your games over the last um, three years, basically. And right here, that ain't no joke. Oh, and yes, as you can see, I have also managed to fix all the dates for each activity. Yep, I managed to change them. Basically, I taped over new dates over the old ones. Yep. Yep, there are new dates. I taped over the old ones. So, for example, the ring hunt is May 13th. Then May 14th tomorrow is the frisbee. Then May 15th is the spray print cans, but I'm pretty sure we're probably going to skip that one because I don't think we have any. Then on May 16th, we will have soccer, which that's going to be cool too. May 17th, we'll have the marathon. May 18th, we will have basketball. May 19th, we will have Green Dodgeball versus Red Dodgeball. And May 20th, we will have Football versus Blue Basketball. And May 21st, we will have The Great Race. And finally, on May 22nd, we will find out which team won the entire event itself. So, we got a lot to do over the next 10 days. Or should I say 11 days, because this actually goes all the way until the new backyard second anniversary day in case any of you were surprisingly curious that actually is true this goes all the way until the new backyard second anniversary day may 24th and then once that day be hap um well once we hit that day it will automatically change to the second anniversary party for the new backyard anyway um, before we get into all the activities, let's look around the rooms. So as you can see, the workshop is decorated. Oh, and by the way, this is the first event in exactly two weeks. Yep, exactly two weeks. The last time we ever had an um, we ever had an event was literally the Earth Day party, which literally began three weeks ago today and ended two weeks ago today. So for the past two weeks, there have been absolutely 100% no events in the backyard whatsoever. Kind of impressed, actually. Haven't gone that long without an event in a long time. So it was nice to bring that back again. And now, finally, after exactly two weeks, a new event is finally here. Woo! Anyway, now that I got that all out of the way, check out the workshop. It has all the team colors. So we got red, green, blue, orange, and purple. Yes, purple. Because, as you can see here, and yes, I did just write over these, like around yesterday. I wrote over these, so they all say the new dates now. Oh, and yes, that is still there from yesterday. And you know, I might even leave that there, actually, because I feel like it, it really feels cool there. Anyway, now that that's it for the workshop, let's get out of here. 
Oh, uh, the purple noodle used to be um, up here, but you know what? Um, I don't really care. Um, now this is well. If you remember back in the Backyard Games 2017, um, yep, the original Backyard Games, which was the first ever Backyard Games yet, or ever, and it was also in the old backyard. Which I cannot believe it's been almost two years since I abandoned that place. Oh man, time really does fly by fast, guys. I cannot believe it's already been two years already, almost. So, guys, um, this is kind of like the purple team area. Um, uh, oh, and right here, um, actually, I'm going to say all those in order because I actually want to say that. So, yeah, basically, we got, like, the purple team area right there. Then over in the tripod area, yes, all that sand is still here. Yep, all this sand is still here. I don't think that's ever going to be going away. But, um, that's there, too. And this is, like, the orange team area cool at the pond view that's the green team area and at the field we have the red team area and yes the logs are back and here at the uh hold on uh, at the tree next to the garden we have the blue team area now as you can see we already have the rings down there. We will get to that later, though. Okay, looks like we got Lucy and Cody here. Yep. Yep, just as, it, just as we expected. I don't really think I've really shown you Lucy before, actually. Or, if, if so, not that much. And then over here is just the normal area over here although there are a few signs um, we'll get to that in a minute first I do want to show you all of this <laughs> um, now over here that's day one right there the rings and by the way if you noticed by the little um, event board for all the games it actually goes in the order of every single game that has been released in the backyard games over the last three years it goes in that exact order so guys tomorrow on may 14th oh uh ooh, a red leaf hold on let me zoom out oh guys guys look a red leaf okay i have never seen that before here you know what? I'm gonna keep it. I'm literally going to keep that, like, right there. I have no idea where that came from, but holy frick, it is awesome. Anyway, again, I just said, it says Frisbee unlocks May 14th, so that is tomorrow. Next up, um, if we go over to the pond view, yeah, there they are right there. But, um, yeah, anyway, uh, if we go down here, whoa, uh, anyway, right down here, this says spray paint unlocks May 15th, so that's in two days on Friday. <sighs> and over here, you probably just saw it earlier, but I'll show it again. Says soccer unlocks May 16th. Yep, soccer unlocks May 16th. That will go right here. All right, what is next? Uh oh, I know. The next two are actually in the same area, basically right here. So, um, hold on. All right, guys. As we can see, right there, that says marathon unlocks May 17th. And right here it says basketball unlocks May 18th. So we got a lot to go through in the next few days. Basically by next week. Yeah, because this goes all the way until the 24th. Which again is the new backyard two year anniversary day. So yep, next. You probably saw this one earlier at the shed, but as you can see here, this says green dodgeball versus red dodgeball unlocks May 19th. So that's next Tuesday. 
Okay, I think Lucy actually likes my workshop. Yep. Definitely looks like it. Okay, looks like I think she wants me. I have no idea what she's looking for, but let's go. Uh, yep, there's Cody back there. Yep, as you know, he also loves the workshop. It looks awesome. Yeah, it's really nice being back here. All right, the next one is in the same place you guys just saw earlier. So, basically the deal is that this says, Football versus Blue Basketball unlocks May 20th, which is exactly a week from today. Yep. Anyway, I think that's actually it. We can actually do our first activity now, which is the ring hunt at the blue team area. So, let's go ahead and pick all those up. Uh, anyway, here we go. And all we gotta do is hide them. Now, of course, like all other backyard games, you obviously have to compete against another person on another team for all of these events, of course. I mean, that was obvious since the beginning. We're making these events in the first place. Yep! However, I was actually thinking of another really cool idea. And I mean, really, really cool idea. I was thinking, let's make a little bit of a twist here now, shall we? And you know what it would be? To, like, find, like, the opposite team's colored rings or something? Or maybe we should still just find all of them. But... I don't know how to, like, do this in any particular way, so... The question, how are we gonna do this? Well, oh, and by the way, it is currently 2.10 p.m. right now. Eastern Standard Time, of course. You know, that's not actually a bad idea if we actually find only the rings of the t five team colors. Yeah! Comment down below if you actually think that's a good idea, or would you want me to find just all of them and overall? And that would also include these. Just comment down below, actually. I would love to hear your feedback. Anyway, you know, to make this ring hunt just a little bit more simpler on me right now, just because I don't want to be out here for too much longer, just because I want to go film some other videos right now. Um, and, um, yeah, I just wanted to just get this done really quick. So all I did was I put the rings in their designated colors. And, um, I know that may sound boring, and yes, I know, that could definitely sound boring, or it may sound interesting to you. I don't know what it may be. Does it sound boring or interesting to you? Please putting all the rings in their designated colors. Do you think that sounds cool, or do you think that sounds kind of boring? I don't mind either way, but, uh... Okay, you have returned. I think she likes my workshop. Yep, it definitely looks like she likes my workshop. I have no idea what's going on, but... Okay, anyway, what we are going to do is we are... Well, all we have to do is do this. <laughs> yep, that's it. All we have to do is this. <laughs> okay, but next up. Woo! Okay, that is. That's pretty insane. Whoa! I almost caught that one. <laughs> nice. I know. I know you guys might just want me to just go put them back in their, like, in better spots. And that's what I'm going to do very, very soon. So, I am probably going to do that right now. Just because I feel like it's better that way. So, yeah, that's just a little example of the ring hunt. I know it'll actually... I feel like every day it might just change to like a specific thing. 
But if you guys like that I actually put them in their specific colors, comment down below. Or if that may have sound boring to you, I'm sorry about that. It's just, um, I just want to kind of just finish off the video here before I make it extremely long. So, um, let's go see if I can do anything else with this. Nope. I think the ring hunt is done for today, so. Yep, we're gonna keep it there. And, um. Yep, there we go. Let's go see if I can go check off that activity. Of course. Out of all things, they are still here. Oh man! Now it is currently 2 16 p.m., so it's been six minutes since I last told you that. Nice. This is here. Thank you guys for watching the video. Remember to like and subscribe. And, whoa, okay, things just fell here. Remember to like and subscribe. I'll see you guys later for uh, Save Your Times 157. No, 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 sorry. Um, 158, sorry about that. Uh, there is also Big of the Season 8, Episode 3. And finally, but not least, an update video. Oh, and today's video of the Season 8 episode is actually going to be how we do Mission 6 of Operation Freeze today in L.I. You're welcome, by the way. Goodbye. Oh, okay, good. Just that only fell. Good enough for me.